Samsung is planning to launch the Galaxy S23, the Galaxy S23 Plus, and the Galaxy S23 Ultra later than previously rumored. According to the latest report, the company will hold an event in the first week of February next year, followed by purchasable stock in mid-February. So hey everyone, I am Ayush and if you are new here, do subscribe now. Ok, we reported a few days ago that Samsung might unveil the Galaxy S23 devices on January 5, 2023. However, we also noted that the promotional materials that were the source of the release date information looked less than reliable. Today, per the South Korean publication chosen, Samsung will announce the Galaxy S23 trio of smartphones in the first week of February, seemingly marking the previous launch date rumors as false. Chosen also alleges that, since Samsung has a history of making the Galaxy S phones available for sale on a Friday after a fortnight of the unveiling, it is likely that users will be able to buy the Galaxy S23, the Galaxy S23 Plus, and the Galaxy S23 Ultra devices on February 17. Comparatively, Samsung unveiled the Galaxy S22 series on February 9, 2022, and the smartphone wasn't really for sale until February 25, or little over two weeks later. If the most recent rumors are accurate, the Galaxy S23 release will be the Galaxy S series flagship phone to hit the market the quickest since the Galaxy S21. So, why is Samsung reportedly releasing the Galaxy S23 devices early? Chosen suggests that the company is doing this to counter a smartphone market that is contracting by 10% year-over-year every quarter. Whether it is January 5th or the first week of February, we won't have to wait too long to find out when the Galaxy S23 series is coming to the market and whether leaks pointing to a revolutionary nighttime photography device in the Galaxy S23 Ultra materialize. The APs of the Galaxy S23 series will mainly be equipped with Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 second generation, but there is a possibility that some models will be equipped with the Exynos 2300, a next-generation AP currently being developed by Samsung Electronics. In addition, it is reported that the top model, Ultra, will be equipped with the industry's highest 200 million pixel camera developed by Samsung. Market research firm Strategy Analytics predicted this year's smartphone market shipments will decline by 9-10% year-on-year, and the decline will continue until the first half of next year due to the economic downturn, price increases, and the aftermath of corona. As consumers' pockets become thinner, online markets in some countries are seeing Samsung surrender the number one spot to low-end brands. An official from Samsung Electronics said, We will increase sales of the Galaxy S series and foldable phones, and strengthen the large-screen premium tablet and wearable, wearable, segments to secure both revenue growth and profitability. So guys, tell me your thoughts about in the comments section. Hope you subscribed to this channel. I will see you in next one.